All right, Steve, you know Gary Kubiak incredibly well. How difficult was this decision for him to step away from coaching due to health issues one year removed from winning a Super Bowl? Well, I think it was a very, very difficult decision for Gary Kubiak. And let, let me just go on record and say this guy is one of the classiest people in the NFL. I had a chance to play for him with the Denver Broncos. He is a man of integrity, a man of faith, a great family man. Uh, he would not make a decision like this without giving it full consideration. He's an unbelievable person. I think he realizes that he's given it his all. He's accomplished so much. And uh, the most yeah. important thing now is to spend time with his family and, uh, and get the most out of what life he's got left. So I, I applaud him for uh, making a very difficult decision but doing the right thing. Very well said, Steve. And Rich, this coaching vacancy in Denver must have potential coaching candidates salivating, right? No, absolutely. I think it's a great situation. You know, the, the chance to go work with someone like John Elway, they've got a great defense, good chance that Wade Phillips stays on as a defensive coordinator. But let me just say this about Gary Kubiak. This is a physically demanding profession. You, know, you have to make a lot of sacrifices, being away from your family and, and uh, the hours that it takes to, to build a championship. I think of Gary as a player. I played against him. I think about his tenure as an assistant coach and certainly a 10-year uh, tenure as a head coach defined ultimately by that win last year in Super Bowl 50. He's going to go down as one of the great ones in this business.